Lions TV post-match reaction to the training game. Sheffield United against Millwall. Millwall v Sheffield United, where it finished. Millwall nil, Sheffield United two. Um, look, I don't think we can take too much um, out of this game, um, other than some positives and some negatives. Um, I think that it shows how important Hutchinson and Cooper are together um, in our in our back line. And if they're not together, we have problems. <clears throat> no idea why Cresswell was playing, other than the fact that he had to, we had to give him a run. Um, as far as I'm concerned, shouldn't be anywhere near the subs bench, in my opinion. I thought he was horrendous today. Um, and listen, we're not going to do well when we've got a, a centre-back that can't defend or pass or after time play football. So, um, yeah, I think if we had Hutch and Coops in the middle there, we it would have been a lot different. Um, listen, people are going to dig me out for this. I'm going to say it, but I, I, I think that Bart could have saved the first goal quite easily. It was at his near post, um, and he's just gone running in. It's kind of made himself big, and the player's just slotted it past him at his near post. If that was George Long doing that, people would have been doing their absolute nut. Um, and the second goal, yeah, all right, was a deflection, but his feet had already been planted. He was hoping that ball was coming near him to save it. Um, if not, it, he wouldn't have got anywhere near it anyway. So, um, the midfield, I thought the mid, I thought George Savile had a good game. I thought he was very demanding. I thought that he was pushing the team forward. Um, Shackleton, for me, was non-existent. Again, shows that having someone like Billy Mitchell in the team um, is very important and critical to the way that we play. Um, I thought that Mason Bennett was non-existent, so that's a good thing to see. Um, as we all, it just sort of cements knowing that we need some wingers in the team, really. Um, Tyler Bury, come on, was awful. I don't understand it. I mean, the guy can hardly use his right foot, and that we put him on the left. It's just, you know, it's not helping Tyler Bury's calls playing him on the left. That's for sure. Um, I thought Romain Sa. I think he can become a brilliant player, but I have just thoughts in my head that he's started being playing because he's because it's the transfer window. Um, the same as the Lovelace situation, wasn't it? All of a sudden, this kid come out of nowhere um, and started playing, and, and that's what happened with Lovelace. Hopefully, SA is a little bit different. Um, and I thought he played all right. I thought, he, I thought out of my, all of our team, he was probably the, the, the best player on the pitch. Um, other than Savile, like I say, I thought Savile played really well. Uh, Vogel Slammer should have scored, um, and Zian Fleming didn't really get into it. But look, it's really difficult, isn't it? Because you, you know, we want to play in the FA Cup. You know, we have history of doing quite well in the FA Cup, and we all love a cup run, us Millwall fans. We love it, but we are fourth in the league. And if you'd ask me what I'd rather have, is you know beat Sheffield United and potentially get, you know, a decent away day or be in the playoffs at the end of the season. Like I know what I know what I'd want to do. So um maybe tactical by Rowett, you know, just let's just play it's a bit like a training game. I don't think any of the players were that bothered. Um it showed by the club not even opening the full stadium, you know, that it that it's not that important to us to an extent. Um so yeah, I'm I'm a bit up and down about it. I'm not really I'm not overly bothered that we lost. Um I just sort of had a look at the tactics and the players instead and just thought, yep, yeah, that was good. No, that's awful. Um we need some signings row it this January, definitely. We need a couple of wingers that actually play down the wing. Um and maybe another striker. Um just to bolster it. Um but other than that, you know, that's all you can take from that. Let's call it a training game. And let's move forward to the to the next game. Come on, you Lions.